Wait Xenon Koopa. Oh my god, I think it's a scary one. I'm I'm. Really Oxygen Koopa. Again? You didn't think it right. Stop being afraid of the other Koopalings. Try to think positively just like that you did to meet some Koopalings. Remember I made too many mistakes. Sorry about that. I thought I saw a scary Koopaling. Okay, I should try. Um, excuse me, are you all scary? Wait what? No. All of us were not scary. Then how come you're not? Oh wait a minute. This were risen Kevin Thomas and Nolan. Hello Oxygen Koopa. I'm Nolan Cody Koopa. My eyes are multicolored. My hair is also multicolored and has a dark blue ponytail. I'm supposed to be twins with Aiden, but Aiden's twin is, you Xenon Koopa. Yep. You could say that you're Aiden's brother, but who's your favorite brother anyway? My favorite brother is Aiden Tefri Koopa. Yeah, bro. Yeah, Xenon and Oxygen Koopa. Aiden T. Koopa is my favorite brother. E -r 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 also, I experienced my bad moments when I got beaten up and grounded on November 4th, 2020. How do you feel about that? What? You got beaten up and grounded on November 4th, 2020 in for higher series? G R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R By who could have ground you? It's not my fault. It was Bad Matthew Cooper Jr. who grounded me on November 4th, 2020 in for higher series. Remember? Ha 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 ha. I grounded him for this. This is what he gets for trying to ground me. How dare you ground my twin brother? That was all messed up for doing that. My twin bro didn't do anything wrong. And I also heard that my twin bro got beaten up. How dare he done this? He didn't deserve this. Jacob Harrington, you should do the grounding. I hate it when my twin gets grounded by a troublemaker. The same thing when my twin bro or me or whoever I love gets beaten up by a troublemaker. Ground him please. What's going on? And why are you angry Xenon Koopa? He just grounded my twin bro just now. <laughs> Wait what? Oh my god. Oh ho 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 no 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 no. This can't be true. How dare you do such a thing to my favorite brother like that? You know what? Let Jacob Harrington give a taste of his own medicine to bad Matthew Cooper Jr. Let's just go inside the house. You, you, you. Oh, 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 I, that's it. You're grounded for, 10 days. Why? Ugh, that bad Matthew Cooper Jr. I hate him for this. And I'm so sorry you had to experience those bad moments two and a quarter years ago, but, I'm not hating you for this. Hi there you both. I'm Kevin G. Koopa. Hello Kevin. Um, why are you holding a basketball? I never expect that he has a basketball. Dude, I have an extremely strong love for basketball to the point where he's pretty much obsessed with it. I started to like basketball ever since I first played it as a child. I am named after the basketball player Kevin Garnett. Never heard of it. Well, let me tell you something about basketball. Basketball was invented on December 14th. 1891 when Canadian James Naismith, a physical education professor and instructor at the International Young Men's Christian Association Training School in Springfield, Massachusetts, was trying to keep his gym class active on a rainy day. I would not and could not hate basketball at all. There are variations of basketball, such as half court, 21, 42, around the world, bounce, firing squad, fives, H-O-R-S-E, Hot shot, knockout, one shot conquer, steal the bacon, tip it, tips, the one, basketball war, one on one, 
a variation in which two players will use only a small section of the court, often no more than a half of a court, and compete to play the ball into a single hoop, beach basketball, a modified version of basketball, played on beaches, dunk hoops, aka dunk ball, a variation of the game of basketball, played on basketball hoops with lowered rims, slam ball, a full contact basketball, with trampolines, street ball, a less formal variant of basketball, played on playgrounds and in gymnasiums across the world, unicycle basketball, played using a regulation basketball on a regular basketball court with the same rules, for example, one must dribble the ball while riding, ring ball, a traditional South African sport that stems from basketball, has been played since 1907. The sport is now promoted in South Africa, Namibia, Botswana, Lesotho, India, and Mauritius to establish ringball as an international sport, korfball, a variation started in the Netherlands and it is now played worldwide as a mixed-gender team ball game, similar to mixed netball and basketball netball, recreational basketball, widely casually in schools and colleges where fun, entertainment and camaraderie rule rather than winning a game, basketball schools and academies, where students are trained in developing basketball fundamentals, undergo fitness and endurance exercises and learn various basketball skills. Basketball students learn proper ways of passing, ball handling, dribbling, shooting from various distances, rebounding, offensive moves, defense, layups, screens, basketball rules and basketball ethics. Also popular are the basketball camps organized for various occasions, often to get prepared for basketball events, and basketball clinics for improving skills, college and university basketball, in educational institutions of higher learning. This includes National Collegiate Athletic Association Intercollegiate Basketball, Deaf Basketball, relies on signing for communication. Any deaf sporting event that happens, its purpose is to serve as a catalyst for the socialization of a low incidence and geographically dispersed population, wheelchair basketball, a sport based on basketball but designed for disabled people in wheelchairs and considered one of the major disabled sports practiced, ethnic and religion based basketball, examples of ethnic basketball include Indo-Pak or Russian or Armenian leagues in the United States or Canada, for example, or Filipino expatriate basketball leagues in the Gulf or the United States. Religion-based basketball includes, most notably, church-related Christian basketball leagues, Jewish, Muslim and Hindu basketball leagues, and so on, show basketball, performed by entertainment basketball show teams, the prime example being the Harlem Globe Trotters, celebrity basketball, made of celebrities, actors, singers, and so on, playing in their own leagues or in public, often for entertainment and charity events, midget basketball, made up of athletes of short stature offering shows using basketball, slam ball, a very intense form of basketball game actually it is an elevated game of basketball that is infused with football tactics and involves bouncing of a trampolines, gay basketball. A major part of events during the gay games, world out games and euro games, Midnight Basketball, a basketball initiative to curb inner-city crime in the United States and elsewhere by keeping urban youth off the streets and engaging them with sports alternatives to drugs and crime, Mini Basketball, played by underage children, Maxi Basketball, played by more elderly individuals, Rizball, the avid Native American following of basketball, particularly a style of play particular to Native American teams of some areas, school or high school basketball, the sport of basketball being one of the most frequently exercised and popular sports in all school systems, and fantasy basketball, popularized by ESPN Fantasy Sports, NBA.com, and Yahoo. Fantasy Sports. Ah. You liked basketball a lot? Yay. I like basketball too much. EMC Grai have a D there. Hey Kevin G. Cuba. You know, I like when you gave a basketball and a clothing to me on my ninth birthday. Hey, I have a basketball too. Maybe you wouldn't mind if I play basketball, since I got it. HMM. Up. Um. Sure, why not? Do you like basketball EMC broad? Yes, I like basketball. It's such a great sport. Really? I extremely like basketball.
I never want to hate this sport for the rest of my life. Boo, what's that clothing you got? No way. That's a great clothing. Thanks. And you know, since I like basketball and you do too, I would have a friend to play basketball. I don't mind about that. Yeah. Wow, such a good clothing he got. Hello, you both. I'm Thomas C. Cooper. Oh my god, what happened to one of your eyes? And oh my gosh, why do you have a bandage on your nose? And why did you got a cane? First of all, I have a wooden cane due to that my right hip is lopsided. Second, one of his eyes is red due to an injury with Tim's rock collection. And third, my nose got hurt due to an injury with Tim's rock collection, I fell on my face. Hey Tim, what a nice rock collection. Oh, oh. My right hip. Whoa, ooh, I'm losing control. Whoa. Oh, oh. I fell on rocks and my nose and my eye hurts. Oh my god, are you okay? It's not my fault. Hang on, I'll try to call to the hospital. You fell on what? Rocks. Ow. Oh my god, ouch. That hurts if you fell into a rock collection on your face. Oh my god. Ooh. Ouch. Yeah. That was painful. I am a bit taller than Iggy. I'm named after the American inventor Thomas Edison. I even invented the light bulb Goomba, called the Goombulb, and Basilei's robot arm since Basilei's right arm was burned. Oh, oh my god. Tough luck for Basilei. He almost felt in the lava. Oh my god, that's so hurtful. Yeah. That really hurts. Oh, hello there you both. I'm Bizzily Cupa. When I was six years old I almost fell in the lava, losing my right arm. Oh no. You lost, your right arm? Ouch, that wasn't very good. Oh my god what a hurtful experience happens to me when I was young. Sadly, I can't play with Kevin just because I lost my right arm. But not to worry, I invented your robot arm called the rocket launcher since you lost your right arm when you're six years old. There. I made a robot arm called the Rocket Launcher. Now you could enjoy putting various devices in this canyon, like a grappling hook. Hooray! Thank you so much Thomas E. Cooper. You're welcome. Because of this, I became buddies with Bazili because I made Bazili's robot arm. Oh good. Yeah, he invented my robot arm since I lost my arm when I was 6 years old. Great. Yeah. After all I'm named after the American inventor Thomas Edison. Oh my god Oxygen Cooper, that was painful. He fell on rocks. Okay hello Oxygen Kepper and Xenon Kepper. I'm Risen Kepper. I'm a young, moody preteen Kepalian. I have a very mixed personality. I had a special iris around his pupil. It changes color, depending which emotion I'm in. Last time I got 4, then 5, then 6, then 7, then 8, then 9, and now 10. Can you guess which eye color can change to? A gray. B light blue. C yellow. D red. E green. F orange. G pink. H purple. I blue. J brown. Okay all of the above. Hmm, let's think about which color can his eye color change. The first emotion he got is normal, which his eyes were colored gray. The second emotion is happiness which his eyes were colored light blue, or cyan if you want to call it. The third one is sadness, which his eye colored red. Fourth one is mad, also known as, angry. He has yellow eye when he gets mad. Number five is confused. He has green eye when he's confused. Number six is bored. He has purple eye when he gets bored. Number 7 is excited. He gets an orange eye when he's excited. Number 8 is scared. He has a brown eye, and the pupil is smaller when he's scared. Number 9 is nervous. He has pink eye when he's nervous. This is not to be confused with the condition known as pink eye. And finally comes sick, he gets a blue eye when he's sick. <laughs> Hey, oh Risen. I got it. It's all of the above. Correct. It's all of the above. I can change my eye color too. Gray if I'm normal. 
Sign if I'm happy. Yellow if I'm mad. Red if I'm sad. Green if I'm confused. Purple if I'm bored. Orange if I'm excited. Pink if I'm nervous. Brown if I'm scared. And blue if I'm sick. All of these makes me very emotional. That's what makes me the best. Oh my god. You have a special pupil? Yep. My eye color can change into 10 emotions. Wow, that's so wonderful you're very emotional Risen Cooper. Why? Thank you so much. You made me happy. I appreciated it Xenon Kepa. That's so kind of you. You're welcome Risen Cooper. How nice of you. Wow, Risen Cooper's eye color change. Did you see that? Amazing, I didn't know he had a special pupil.